scenes like this here behind me as we stand on Miller Road in Malden are a common sight across the upstate into the mountains. Western North Carolina or Western Carolina is getting hit hard by those hurricane force winds that we saw in some parts of the area. Those winds gusting 70 to 75 miles per hour, even in parts of the upstate, taking out these ginormous trees. You can see this particular tree laying across Miller Road and with it, it took down those power lines, which is of course why we're seeing a lot of power outages. But one thing I want to point out to you is that orange and white barrier, and that is there to protect you. So make sure that you're paying attention to those barriers. Do not drive around those. They are there to protect you from down power lines, from dangerous situations, impassable roads, whether that's from trees or flooding. All of these things need to be taken seriously. Of course, we had those incredible winds with this storm as it came through on Friday. That is what is responsible for most of these power outages as well as the tree damage across our area. Uh, we're continuing to the cleanup process. Things are moving along, but it's going to be probably several days before things get completely back to normal and a lot of the roads are open. We've watched a lot of people roll up on this particular road thinking that they're going to come right down Miller Road wherever they're headed and having to turn around and find an alternate route. That is likely going to be an issue for the next handful of days as things continue to get cleaned up. I'm First Alert Meteorologist Chrissy Kohler.